five hacks how to find skate spots no matter where you are. Churches always have the sickest roofs, I feel like. Look at that thing. Before we get into the meat of today's video, I do want to say you should have a good skate spot etiquette, understand how precious skate spots are, and also know that you're going to have to put a lot of work in before you get a bunch of skate spots. So the first obvious way to find your skate spots is just using the Maps app on your phone. I like to use the Apple Maps app because you can go to satellite mode, and in satellite mode you can actually see you know, the greenery, real life. Uh, landscape so it's a lot easier and then you can even turn it into 3d mode so then you can like look around and you know sort of find spots I like to look for ditches schools parks any obvious landscape and then you can kind of look around that area but yeah I found a lot of spots just using the maps app so no matter where you are you basically go to your current location and look around in that area the thing you can really do that really helps that I've done and found a lot of spots is just Take another route, an alternative route, no matter where you're going. So like, I go to the same job every day, but I always take a different route. So I'll like get to the freeway in a different way. I'll go home a different way. Always just taking different roads that you're not familiar with, and that's how you end up finding spots as well. It's just like investigating the area. Like I thought I saw something down here the other day. There we go, gold right here. Check this spot out. Fucking palm tree with concrete on it. So sick. Can we get on that tree? I'll try to ride up the tree a little more. is to constantly explore the area that you're at on foot. So if you're going to a certain skate spot or going to a skate park or you're going to lunch date or something like that, just explore that area on foot. My friend Truman Hooker is like professional at this. I swear he's found like 50% of the spots just because like he'll go somewhere for that one specific thing but then look around that area on foot. So definitely look around the area that you're at. Again, even if you're familiar with it, constantly looking. But anyways, we're at this DIY spot with the boys. We're gonna get a quick section. Let's get into it. for finding ski spots is one that I feel like is forgotten about a lot and I used to do it so much when I was a kid me and my friends all the time is looking really hard in the background of skate photos printed in the magazine or in skate videos so you have to try to find a business name a mountain range anything any kind of landmark a sign a street sign anything like that and you just go look it up online basically do a little you know CSI investigation uh, so lurk hard in the background, that's the fourth hack. Ha <laughs> ha 
thing looks like a mini ramp. Fifth and final hack for finding ski spots is just going to your local skate park, um, checking it out. Even if you don't know anybody there, just go talk to people, meet people. The skate park is definitely the first spot I would go to to finding skate spots because you're going to find like-minded people that are trying to do the same thing as you. Hopefully this video sparked you to get out there and find some skate spots. going to leave you with going to the skate park. With the camera in hand.